Now, teachers at Matthew Goniwe High School in Cape Town say they fear for their safety as armed robberies spike in the area. Back in May, an educator was robbed allegedly by pupils less than a kilometer away from the school. Teachers say they want increased police visibility in the area. News from Africa's Nasipi Same has the story. Matthew Goniwe Memorial High School teachers staged a picket on Monday outside the Kailicha police station over safety concerns outside the school premises. The morning of May 12th, a teacher's life was turned upside down as she was robbed at gunpoint on her way to work. It's been nearly a month since the incident happened and she is yet to resume her duties. What is it that I cannot take is that two of those boys who were robbing me are from my school. The one is a grade 8 learner and the one is a grade 10 learner. I'm not the only teacher. These incidents were happening. They were happening. They did that to my colleagues, which five or six of us, the females, were robbed at gunpoint. Now they are coming closer to the place of work. We are afraid because when we're discussing that, we thought maybe they're going to come inside the, premise, the school premises. The Western Cape Education Department's Safe Schools says it has engaged law enforcement regarding school safety and visible policing. In the same breath, the Department of Education says it is not in a position to control what happens outside of the school gate and within communities. In the previous MEC's tenure, uh, she had gone and said that uh, what happens outside the school is not their jurisdiction. We hope that the, the new MEC indicated that he was concerned about safety. Now, safety is not only on the premises in terms of what the uh, Occupational Health and Safety Act says. Safety is about how we have our safe communities. So therefore, the politicians need to play their, their role uh, in the overall uh, protection of the teachers, the learners, etc. Four suspects were arrested and appeared in court and will return to court on 14 June. They were released on parental custody as they are juveniles. For News from Africa on Channel 405, I am Nasipis Same in Cape Town.